Voyager 2 has been traveling outward for almost 50 years, moving farther from the sun than any spacecraft humans have ever built. It drifts slowly through a region where sunlight grows faint and the solar wind becomes weak. Each year, it enters darker, quieter space, carrying its long journey's story and the faint signals that reach Earth from places no human has ever visited. Its journey feels like a bridge to the unknown. The spacecraft was built when technology was simple and computers were slow. Most people thought it would last only a few years. Yet Voyager 2 survived the harsh radiation near Jupiter and the freezing darkness near Neptune. Even after decades, it continues into the emptiness beyond the planets, still sending data back to Earth. Its ability to communicate after so long feels almost unreal. In 2018, Voyager 2 crossed the edge of the heliosphere, the bubble shaped by the sun's energy. Scientists expected a smooth, gentle change as it left the sun's influence. Instead, it detected sudden and sharp shifts. Plasma became denser, magnetic fields locked in place, and cosmic radiation jumped by almost 70%. It was like stepping through an invisible doorway into a new type of space. The heliosphere turned out to be more active and delicate than anyone guessed. It expands when the sun is active and shrinks when the sun calms, moving like a living, breathing boundary. Voyager 1 and 2 crossed this boundary at different times and distances. This showed that the edge of our solar system is not fixed, but shifts like something alive. Magnetic field readings also surprised scientists. They expected tangled, chaotic fields where the sun's magnetism met the galaxies. Instead, the fields aligned as if they belonged together. This strange harmony suggested that forces we do not yet understand shape the structure around our solar system. Voyager 2 was revealing mysteries beyond imagination. In 2019, Voyager 2 suddenly stopped sending signals. More than 11 billion miles away, it went silent. Engineers waited, unsure if it had finally stopped working. Weeks later, it returned to life. The explanation pointed to aging electronics, but the raw data revealed strange spikes unlike anything seen before. Soon, Voyager 2 detected slow, repeating pulses in the plasma. These pulses occurred every 13.2 hours. They did not come from the sun and did not match any known cosmic source. The pulses were too regular to be noise. They sounded like something in deep space was rhythmically vibrating, suggesting the solar system's boundary might be more active than expected. Some scientists wondered if Voyager was not just crossing a border, but interacting with something at that edge. The spacecraft seemed to be observing, and perhaps being observed. Over time, the mysteries multiplied. Voyager's communication delay shifted as if the space between it and Earth was bending. When data was converted into sound, it resembled a heartbeat. Another instrument picked up bursts of energy that seemed random. Yet when graphed, they formed a spiral pattern following the Fibonacci sequence, a natural order seen in seashells, flowers, clouds, and galaxies. Random turbulence should not produce such precise structure. Inside NASA, some researchers began calling this the response field. It seemed as though something was reacting to Voyager, growing stronger as it traveled deeper. Then magnetic field readings flipped in ways no known object could cause. Space appeared to fold around the spacecraft, bending time and energy in impossible ways. Some theories suggested the heliopause might act like a one-way membrane, letting things leave the solar system but blocking entry. Voyager 2 seemed to reveal properties no one expected. The data soon became even stranger. Timestamps appeared from years ago, systems that had been dead flickered on, and instruments aligned with stars passed long before. Faint images sent back were blurry, almost like memories, not belonging to the spacecraft, but to the space around it. This raised profound questions. 
Could space itself record the passage of everything that moves through it? Voyager 2 was never designed to uncover meaning. It was meant to travel outward and send information until its power faded. Instead, it revealed signs of order where emptiness was expected. Its signals now feel like more than measurements. They feel like echoes, recognition from the unknown. Something may be noticing us in the darkness beyond our solar system. We did not just send a spacecraft into space. We knocked on a door without knowing who or what was behind it. Voyager the 2nd of May have received an answer, quietly waiting to be understood. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.